I think last year, you know, we had a successful season, even though we didn't uh, make the NCAA tournament the first time in 12 years. I thought, you know, we still ended up as a top 15 team and had a good go. We just lost some really close games, and unfortunately we lost a really close one in our conference championship game. And But we got a majority of those guys back, and we're excited about the direction we're heading, and, and especially only losing um, our face-off guy and our goalie and the majority of the guys that we have back starting, which is great in the freshman class that we think is excellent. Uh, but, you know, we think we got so the same. The goal for us is the same. You know, we want to win a national championship, get back to the NCAA tournament, win our conference. And so those goals remain consistent from year to year. We're lucky enough to have several of our All-Americans back from a year ago. You know, Ryan Coleman was a two-time All-American for us over the last few years. And, and Cam Lydig was a, is a three-time All-American for us back. And uh, Josh Brandon was a second-team All-American. And we think we have some other guys who are going to be very good for us uh, this coming year, especially Mitch Lashman, who's an attackman for us. And we have Dylan Linhart, who was back with us two years ago. He's an excellent addition, but Jack Scalati and especially um, uh, Grant Zick are both two excellent players for us that can really do a lot of damage and, and having uh, Griffin Gas back in that midfield area helps us as well. So we think we got a lot of guys in that area can really come back, especially uh, and especially guys we think should be deserved a lot more as you know, Ryan Quinn and, um, and Maul Levy who had excellent years down low for us uh, working. So we think that all those guys have potential to get honors this year at some point. Uh, freshman class this year, we're real lucky to get some good guys. You know, we have guys from about eight different states, and uh, you know they're really going to help us. Uh, some of the midi D's are uh, going to help us uh, right away, and I think some of the the midfielders, especially a guy like Alex Wilson and Colin Dobbins and um, and Connor Remington, are all guys that, especially in the midfield, that I think can help us early in the season. Uh, and especially if we get some injuries, uh, those are guys are really outstanding players, and the rest of the guys are going to be good players. We think come down the road. Yeah, every year, you know, we play a real challenging schedule, and so you know. We usually play eight or nine of the top ten teams in, in a row and and so you know starting right out of the gate you know we're gonna play a ranked team in your sinus and then we play number two uh, CNU and then we play a Catholic who was an NSA team a year ago then we play Gettysburg who's a top ten team Lynchburg's a top ten team Dickinson and RIT only lost one game between the two of them a year ago and then we play Salisbury who's another top five team so you know we, we, the way we uh, uh, go about it each and every week is that you know we want to play our best each week so we have to practice that way and limit our mistakes and, and I think that's the way we've kind of gone you know, we've been a tough out. We just got to do a better job when the game matters the most in the last five minutes, seven minutes of the game, not turning the ball over, making uh, our opponents pay for their mistakes while they make, they've make they done a great job making us pay for our mistakes. So we have to limit their their chances and when they make mistakes really kind of cash in. And I think those guys have done a great job of the preseason. We do a lot of situational type stuff to help us get better at that and I think it's really paid off and in our first scrimmage is going to do that and then we'll see how it goes in Hanson Sydney and before we get ready for that opener at your sinus. Yeah, I think it's been, I think we know the guys have done really well. You know, hard. We got a good group coming back, especially our super seniors. Uh, the six guys that came back are uh, really going to help us a lot. They're quality individuals, and what I really like about this team is that they are. Our culture is great. They've done a great job, and we continue to build that way. And the family atmosphere that we have is really growing each and every year, especially even with Cam and Matt Wilson being four-year captains, and now having Damian uh, Schmidt. And uh, Jack Scalati to uh, add captains this year to add some new guys into there. They've done a tremendous job, and we're excited to get on there. And we hope all our fans come out to see us. We're really excited about the year and can't wait to get out there in our first home game against CNU.